Shannon Torville with Shannon Torville, John L. Scott, Salem, Oregon Real Estate. And I am here to talk to you guys about the update. We talked May last month. This month we're talking about June. I know we're in the middle of July, but right now we're going to talk about June and some of the updates and trends that we're seeing. The market's changing, you guys, and it's important that we know what's going on and we stay up to date with it so we can be prepared to help you buy or sell your home. So I'm going to do a little compare and contrast from last month just so we can kind of keep up with everything that's going on. The biggest one, I'm going to look at my notes a little bit like I will every month that we do this. <laughs> um, but the biggest thing is in the Willamette Valley, so all, that's Marion, Polk, Lynn, and Benton County, the Willamette Valley. This is the market update for the Willamette Valley. Uh, last month, homes were selling for an average of $380,000. This month, they're selling for an average of $390,000. So that's a little bit of a jump, right? Um, days on market last month was 18 days on average on market this month it's 17 days on market so one day sooner they're getting through and then in May they were selling for in just the Willamette Valley uh, they were selling 103.9% over asking and now it's 103.8 so it's going down a little bit so what does that mean for you that means that when you are looking to buy a home if you want to have a competitive offer you might want to look into offering a little bit over asking or know that there could be an offer that is over asking, maybe three, five, 10%, something over asking price. Um, that can happen and things are happening fast. We are seeing a little bit of a change in the sense that some of the homes are staying on the market a little bit longer. I check the market almost daily. I don't want to commit to saying daily, but almost daily. And um, I'm seeing homes not active. I'll see, I'll look for a weekend, I'll go and look at some houses in the following week. I still am seeing the same houses active, which means that they're not selling as fast, which is good for the buyers out there. If you're trying to get your offer accepted, there are homes that are available, so be aware of that. I also wanted to give a little update, not just on the Willamette Valley, but just on Salem as a whole, because that's where I am, and I wanted to kind of hyper-focus on Salem a little bit, just to give you guys an update of where we are just in the Salem, city Salem limits. Um, homes in June were selling on average of $389,000. So a little bit under Willamette Valley, um, but still more than last month, 389,000. Days on market was 18, so competitive. It's a little bit under the um, county, but it is still right in there. And then we're at 103.5% over asking. So everything is really about the same, just a little bit of tweaks, a little bit less here in Salem than some of the big Valley and things like that. Please like and subscribe if you are new here. Um, and then I also have my first time home buyers guide that I will link there that I will send you um, via email. So feel free to grab um, hold of things and I will see you guys next time.